All right, welcome back to KM6LYW Radio Short Attention Span Edition. Hey, we've got a new release of the DigiPi version 1.8 Mark III. It's really just a bug fix uh, update with a couple of new neat features. DigiPi is an amateur radio transceiver SD card image that you get at digipi.org. It goes to patrons the KM6LYW Radio. You hook it up to your radio and it gives you access to every data mode there is and all available via your tablet or maybe more more specifically a web browser. So what's new in DigiPi 1.8 Mark III? We've got a cool, uh, the screen, the little LCD screen that you see here, this little guy. We, If you don't have the, the $12, I know you do. If you don't have the $12 for that screen, you can actually display the contents of that screen on, you click on screen down here and you can see what's going on. So you can see all of your stations flying by and the DigiPi status what it's up to. Um, in addition to the screen thing, we fixed a lot of bugs like uh, APRS on HF now works. It wasn't working right before. In fact, did you guys know there's APRS on HF? It's a 10.1476 megahertz upper sideband global APRS network. It works with uh, web chat if you want to do the web chat stuff so you can talk with people all over the world using nothing more than APRS web chat which is integrated with the DigiPi as you can see there. Um, other things, um, the, the, the WSJTX and JS8 call, they all maximize full screen now inside your web browser. Uh, we fix log rotate again, redu reduce the number of acts that web chat is sending back and forth and resending messages in the APRS protocol stack. The uh, temperature sensor and GPS that are integrated into the DigiPi hat, which is the little hat on here that you can use to hook up to your dual band rig like your Baofeng. Um, the GPS and temperature sensor drivers are loaded in there. We added the gate path for APRS. We added forward error correction to the HF APRS. I know I'm talking about APRS and HF a lot, but forward error correction is on there now. So when you do send a packet over APRS over HF, um, it's much more likely to get through based on the forward error correction. Uh, little things like the bulletin board AX.25, uh, some bug fixes there, net ROM D start. So anyways, DigiPi 1.8 Mark III has all of those fixes. Um, this isn't by no means a complete demonstration of what the DigiPi does. Go see my other videos. In fact, go watch the video for DigiPi 1.8 Mark II if you want to really kind of see a demonstration on how this works. So patrons, head on out to digipi.org uh, to get your DigiPi SD card image. And this has been another short attention span version of KM6 LYW Radio. My name is Craig. I'm in California, and I am clear. <laughs>